Hello everybody, I am Yolanda Marie. I do have a message from the Arcturians today and it's coming through with a lot of high frequency activation. Activation of understanding, embedding this into your consciousness. This is very important because this is the type of energy right now, while all of this broad and expansive energy or we should say energies because they are different types of energies streaming across the planet, activating people. Some of this energy, and this is coming through now, is actually coming from you. Okay, so I didn't expect them to come through in this moment, but they are saying, and these are the Arcturians, much of the energy which is cascading across your planet at this time is highly activational and indeed is propagated by your own expansion. It is indeed multiplied. So you are providing multiplicity through yourselves of this energy. And so therefore it's very widely available to people. We would like you to be aware of this because as your consciousness attends to something. So in other words, the attention you give something again, multiplies the powerful effect that thing we are talking about has on circumstances, people, situations, things, creations. It's creative energy and it is potentiated through your heart frequency. And this indeed is how you are choosing to benefit the planet at this time. We are the Arcturians. Okay, so there the Arcturians are confirming for you, for some of you, what you may have suspected already, but many of you really are not realizing a lot of this energy is indeed coming from you. All right, so we are going to keep going. I'm going to mostly quote from the message the Arcturians put through a few days ago now. This is actually channeled June 23rd, <laughs> now that I'm looking at it, okay? So a while ago, but the energy has been so erratic erratic in a good way, but it feels really tumultuous, especially to the physical planetary structure. Many of you know that. So depending on where you are, you know, just be safe, take care of yourselves. The planetary structure is experiencing a lot of movement, purging, shifts, shifts in balance, shifts in the way certain structures are put together, basically. And that is going to appear to us many different ways. It just depends. You know, we will perceive that many different ways. Let's put it that way. All right. So the Arcturians are saying there is a stretch happening. And within this stretching, an arc of opportunity. Within such a space, it is possible to feel anxious as though you are at a standstill. But remember, nothing is actually still. Everything is always in motion. Not only your cosmic space, your galaxy, even your universe, but all universes and dimensions, even when they appear to be at rest, there is always the opportunity for creation and therefore motion. Everything is in motion while also within the void of nothingness. Do not confuse your time of rest as complete void. That's really important, you guys. <laughs> They're literally stopping me there to just really emphasize this point, okay? Don't confuse any time of rest that you're experiencing where you feel maybe like you're at a standstill as a void because you are indeed very active. That's what they're talking about. So the Arcturians are saying conversely to what we have just stated, the void is nothingness, but is also light. To your visible spectrum, this would not be true, okay? You tend to separate, you meaning us, I'm including myself here, guys. You tend to separate darkness from light because of your relative human experience. However, they are in fact the same or rather two sides of the same coin. And therefore, depending on your frequency and what physical laws apply to your experience, your ability to perceive the creative energy in both will vary. This will not be as confusing an idea to you if you simply close your eyes. Within that darkness, you can still feel the activity 
not only the other functions of your body that did not cease, of course, but the mere knowing of the darkness. You intuitively understand that it does exist. And within that very existence breeds the promise then of light. It is an inevitability. Listen to that word that they used, you guys. The Arcturians are saying this is inevitable. What they're talking about is always applied to all of your experiences. And this is very important for you to understand what a powerful generator, creator, creative being you really are. So they say it is an inevitability. So you see, to a degree, there is movement there. There is always movement and therefore always something being created, destroyed, and both happen through the energy of love <laughs> because that in itself is indeed creation. We remind you of this so that you may find it easier to release the anxiety that somehow you are missing necessary movement at this time. Simply practice within yourself a belief that the subtle energetic movement that the standstill or the pause provides is indeed exactly the quantum fluctuation required to steer your experience toward its next great victory. See your own success within this void. We love you. We are the Arcturian Council and Transmission.